Hello, hello, hello. This is your girl Andrea back with another video from Thrifted Beauty. If you are new to my channel and you like things like thrifting and lifestyle, get ready with me and date nights and vacations and all that good stuff, then you are in the right place. Please hit the like and subscribe button, hit the bell notification so you don't miss a thing. If you are one of my oldie but goodies, it's Sunday. Come on in. You know what time it is. It's time for us to discuss what? Thrifting. That's what we're discussing today. Now, on last weekend, if you watch my video, you saw I was under the weather. I was really nasally. I'm still a little nasally now. I don't sound as bad as I did then. I am feeling much better. And I only showed you partial, uh, a partial amount of my thrift. So, I'm going to show you the rest. I'm going to show you my really, really good finds. And I was holding those so I could show you. I'm really excited about this video. So, I'm not going to hold you up. We're going to get right into it. I'm going to start showing you my thrifty stuff. So, I'll be going back and forth because, you know, my thrifty stuff is over here. And I'm going to come back over here. All right, let's get it. So, as I've told you in other videos, I have been looking for, like, some colored leather because I had to get rid of a lot of coats and things like that. Take it in for a minute. This is like a maroon color moto jacket, okay? Look at the price. Now, I'm not happy about the price, but I got better after I saw what I saw. So this is $18.50, you know, which is kind of high for the thrift stores, but it's leather. The reason why it's $18.50 is because it's brand new and was originally $99.50. So I got over that real quick. Um, this is William Rast and it's founded by Justin Timberlake and Tracy Ayala. But I'm super excited because my last moto jacket was um, New York and Company, Jones of New York or something like that. And it was like an olive green and I loved it. But we talked about how the guns have been thriving in COVID. So I had to get something else. But that's this and I love it. I found something that I have been looking for for a long time. I could have purchased it from a retail store, but I did not because I am a thrifter and it's all in the find. It's the art of the find. So, I found me a bustier, corset, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, I'm super excited. This was $9.98. This is, let's see if I, Fredericks of Hollywood. If you don't know Fredericks of Hollywood, they are a little naughty lingerie place that you, you know, you can go get your little lingerie from for these special moments, like honeymoons and things like that, but that's this. I'm so excited. I've been looking for this for so long. $9.98 and I found it. All right. So next up, I have a little bit of lace. I can't tell you how much this is because my price tag fell off, but that's okay. It's from a company called Forgotten Grace. Now this is oversized, this is like a 3X, but that's all right too because it's lace. You can wear this with like some jeans and like a leather jacket or you can wear it with some slacks and like a, a cardigan or something like that. There's a lot of things you could do with this, but laces in style throughout all seasons. So I love this. And I showed you some uh, pajama pants last time on my last video and I actually got two pair when I went. Um, these are $2.50 and I don't have who they're from. But aren't they a fun pattern? Look at that color. Look at that. I mean they look like pajama pants by themselves. Of course they look like pajama pants but it's all in how you style them. But I think these are cute. I'm going to wear these out somewhere. <laughs> being comfortable. I love these. Okay. I have an oversized vest. A lot of these things I'm showing you are also trending on the runway. Um, like I said, I don't really follow trends, but I seem to kind of be in them anyway, just off my personal style, which I don't know if that's good or bad. Um, but this is a men's sweater vest, $3.50, Paul Frederick, and it's not tan. It's sort of like a peach's coat. Peach color <laughs> but it's oversized and I love that too you know I can wear this with a shirt dress you know I can wear this with some jeans and a long sleeve under it turtleneck under it whatever belted or not whatever um, but I love this it's super cute I found a gray turtleneck um I don't think I have gray turtlenecks maybe I have like chunky knit gray sweater I think I got that but not a great turtleneck. But this one was 
$3.50. And I'm looking, why is there? All right, so there's not a tag in here to tell me who this is from, which is unfortunate because this is just not your regular, ordinary turtleneck. It has like this little, see this little, I don't know if you can even see that, that split in the front. It's like a split here and a split here, just kind of ramping it up a little bit. I just thought it was cute and I look for different, so I haven't seen anything like this and I thought, you know, I can rock it. Who better than me, right? All right. Now, this, the particular thrift store I went to, I believe all of this is from Value Village. Um, but they have a new section in the store and it's up close to the front. And I don't know whether these are like donated clothing from retail stores or whatever. They're not necessarily thrift store price. They come with their price tags already on them. Um, this one happened to be $5.99 and it's from Falls Creek. So it's like a little sweatshirt, right? Well, look at the sleeves, okay? I love that, that little drop shoulder, puffy. That's super cute. I can wear this with whatever, but like I said, I like different. I like putting, um, I don't know, like a dressy element with athletic wear, so super cute, super cute. Now, on my last video, I talked about saturated colors for fall. So I did find another coat and because I'm replacing my wardrobe here. Now this coat is a 22W. I'm not a 22W, but it's a coat. As long as the sleeves aren't too dramatically long, I feel like it's okay. But this was $3.50 from JG Hook. I'm gonna show you the inside first. Look at that cute little fun polka dot pattern. But then look at the color, look at that green. Is this Kelly green? Is that what this is called? But I thought this was really cute. And it's, it's not super thick, but it's not thin either. It's not a jacket, it's not a coat, it's in between. Um, but that's really cute. The only part, and I may do some adjustments. Sometimes I do minor adjustments, minor sewing adjustments. Um, but this little belt right here in the bag, which is not a real functioning belt, is kind of big because it's set for a 22W. So I may just kind of take it in a little bit so it makes more sense on the back, or I might leave it, because I mean, it's not hurting anything. I may get hooked on something, but it's not hurting anything. So I thought this was really cute. And I had, to, I had to have had a flash from the past, right? So this is what I decided I wanted to get. These are Elite Jeans, and they are Acid Wash Damaged Skinny Jeans. I don't know where I'm going to the 80s, I guess. <laughs> but I thought these were really, really cute. See that? That's really cute. I mean, you can, it's jeans, you can wear it with anything, but acid wash, um, I know this is on trend, and I, I bought these just because I don't have any acid wash, outside of a acid wash skirt that has suspenders on it. Um, but I thought this would be cute to add into my wardrobe, and you can never have enough jeans, okay? And then of course, I love this color blue. Um, my husband would call this Carolina blue because we are Carolina fans, but this is Kim Rogers, and it's just a V-neck, long sleeve sweater, but this can't go with anything, but I just love this color blue. So I'm not sure how I'll style this. I think I have like a shirt that has like a little bow tie on it. Um, I may style it with that. I don't know, but that's super cute. Last but not least, because I did have to give away a couple of my, I call them track suits, but when I say track suits, people are thinking of the windbreaker material, jogging sets, I guess. Uh, and it's this, in this pretty, pretty color blue. Look at that with a little white on the side. This set was $4.50. And most times when you're shopping at the thrift store, you're not gonna find a skinny leg on like a jogging set like this. It's gonna be like a wide leg, which is okay, because I like to wear heels with my stuff anyway. You know, I'm so huge. Anyway, that's this. And did I tell you who it was from? Ice, nope. I see fashions. I was gonna say ice fashions, but it's I see fashions. So that's that. And that is the end of my haul. And you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna clean this stuff and I'm gonna come back with it all styled up and looking nice. Do I have more thrifted items that I haven't shown you? Of course I have. But I wanted to show this stuff. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and clean this and then come back and style it up 
and we're gonna get right into it. Let's go.
what you think? Did you like my video? Did you like the way I styled up my items? I hope you did because I had a ton of fun like I always do. It's like playing dress up. You know, so if I have an audience, instead of it being me by myself, my, my young child self playing dress up, I get to wear makeup and all this stuff. It's, it's every girl's dream. But I hope you enjoyed everything I showed you today. I hope you got some ideas for some more fall wear and some ways to put your outfits together. If you were new to my channel and you lasted all the way to the end of this video, hit the like and subscribe button, hit the bell notification so you don't miss any of my videos or shorts or anything else. Follow me on Instagram as well, Pinterest and all the other sites. Um, I should have a link here or here when the video starts or ends, I don't know. Okay, and if you are old to my channel, Thank you. Thank you for watching again. I love you guys. You are so loyal. Keep watching. Keep telling your friends about my channel. My subscribers are growing every day, which is super awesome. And I love you guys, and I'll see y'all next Sunday.